We've got a fantastic guest with us, joining us, Vikas Khanna. He is a celebrity chef, uh, somebody who's been on MasterChef in the past. Thanks very much for being with us. Uh, great to have you, particularly in times like this, which have been difficult for farmers. There's been a great deal of distress, incredible losses. What do you think we can all do to support farmers and the agrarian sector at a time like this? I ask you this because you've been looking at this very closely. It's time that we are buying a lot of ration directly from farmers. You also have to remember this was the harvest season. Yep. And uh, <clears throat> many of my ration which we are distributing, uh, almost like 25 to 35 percent is coming directly from farmers, which is a direct relief because they get paid right on the time. And uh, it, that is something which is very essential. Okay. Now, tell us a little bit about your efforts, the fact that you've been working on uh, dry rations. Uh, you've been feeding lakhs of people, in fact. That's helped farmers directly or indirectly. Tell us a little bit about your efforts in this regard. Uh, we have the major initiative which we have is dry rations to old age home, orphanages and leprosy centers. This one I started on, May, on uh, April 1st. And then after that, we started doing uh, cooked meals, which is we have two kitchens. One is in Noida, which serves NCR. And the second one is in Bombay, which serves the greater Bombay region, in which every morning we do cooked meals, which are packed. And then they are delivered by N uh, NR, the National Disaster Response Force, NDRF. Now, one, uh, one other question. You did, you did the Eid feast, right? across several cities, I'm told. How did you get this idea? It was a great idea. How did, how did, this, how did it all happen for you? The Eid feast, the, the big one was only in Haji Ali in, in Bombay, where we had uh, almost 200,000 meals, not people. And it was like everything was laid out and people could bring bag and take as much as they want. Eid was important to me because um, I think it's great that right now we need to celebrate hope and hope yeah. is everything we are sharing right now. And that's what we're well, trying in a little, little humble efforts. Well, thank you so much. Uh, and it's, it's fantastic that you've, you've been contributing in such an active way. Thanks very much indeed.